Hi, John Marshall, the Drill Master. I have in front of me the University of uh, South Florida. Their performance at Tulane. Just a, a, a brief snippet of what uh, what they did. And so, in J. Rotsi competitions, uh, anytime the flag is the American flag is is uh, disrespected, it's it's grounds for disqualification. Um, as a as a judge, I would highly suggest anybody when they see that they uh, they let the team perform, they let the team go through their sequence of of, uh, of commands, and then uh, score them and and give them feedback, and then at, right after, I would say then you're disqualified because the flag is uh, has been disrespected. So what's disrespect to the flag? Well, it's this right here. Marching the flag on the left, marching the American flag on the left. That's unacceptable. That that has it's not even in the the realm of of a possibility. Honestly, now I've made mistakes. Definitely, when I uh, I can I can tell you stories about uh, I've even fallen in on the wrong side for uh, a color guard as the American flag bearer and my teammates. You know, just before we're about to go to the through this the ceremony on on my base honor guard, um, my teammates are looking at me like, uh, "What are you What are you doing?" And oh, oh yeah, I'm not thinking properly. Okay. And then we switch, and, and everything's fine. You're not paying attention. You're not paying attention to here at all to detail. It's it's a sh a shame, honestly. So uh, anyway, that's disrespect to the flag. Also, when the harness sockets are so that the American flag is lower than uh, what other when uh, any other flags that are there. Uh, when it's carried lower than the other flags, then that's grounds for disqualification as well. Let's watch this. Right there. What are you doing? What was the command, guards? The command was eyes right. What do we do on eyes right? That's it. Nobody goes to present on the command of eyes right. Nobody goes to present on the command of eyes right. That's disappointing. It really is. You put a lot of practice into this. I can tell. I the the marching technique you're using just super it really is you're following the marine corps order with your with your turns and that'll come up in just a sec i've, I've watched this once through already and that was your your marching is just stellar it really is but i disqualify you absolutely hands down no problem no problem at all but this is just Boy. No. So, ready front, ready cut. There is no ready cut after ready front. But look at the step there. I mean, that's just absolutely fantastic. Now, you're marching shoulder to shoulder, and you shouldn't be. Uh, this flag is too big for the staff it looks like it could actually be four by six but it should be four or maybe even five nine i'm not exactly sure here and it's larger than this is another disrespect to the american flag thing it's larger than the american flag you have a three by five american flag and you have a look what looks like a it's probably a four foot four inch by five foot six inch air force flag and they're colors; they're not flags because of the 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 staff sleeve and and the the fringe attached. 
but you that's that's two ways that you're disrespecting the American flag and these judges didn't even pick it up because he's got a stripe no experience oh, very frustrating to watch this you got good grips guards v very well done there nice job your mark time step is too high way too high on that mark time so on mark time your knees uh, left rifle guard your knees are pointing outward they should be pointing forward everybody should have them pointing forward so it's just a matter of of uh, of creating new muscle memory at the hips that's where you're going to rotate uh, inward honestly if if you were marching ceremonial manual Uh, this would be really good. The ceremonial manual would then require you to uh, march shoulder to shoulder, and you're doing an excellent job of it, honestly. But you can't march shoulder to shoulder. You have to march at close interval. Left guard, need to bring your hand down just a bit. Get that forearm horizontal. You speed up also on your mark time. All right, well, I'm not going to go over this and belabor the point, but you've disrespected the American flag in two ways. Uh, the Air Force also cannot carry 3x5 colors. 3x5 is not a military size. 3x4 is. But since you're carrying that gigantic uh, Air Force flag, it so... Uh, it looks like you have uh, nine and a half foot staffs and not eight foot. So if you have nine and a half foot staffs, that's the correct length for that Air Force flag or the Air Force color. But the Air Force color is too big for the uh, for the staff. So I'm I'm thinking that it is uh, a four by six. So I'm I'm not exactly sure though. So the flag dimensions are wrong. The uh, staff length looks correct, um, but. Yeah, you're marching the, the flags in the wrong positions. And that's such a shame because, like I said, you, you're doing so well. You put in tons of practice, tons of practice, all for essentially nothing. But from what I understand, you were given an extraordinary amount of points because you're it's impressive to watch but that just goes to show you that the judges didn't know what they were seeing all right well thanks for watching appreciate it